Today we're in the gym because I have a lot of young men around me. They all want to work out and get big muscles and be strong. But uh, I want to share something from the scripture that I want all the young men that I get a chance to influence with, uh, with these very words what Paul wrote to Timothy. Now Timothy was a young man who Paul called his son in the faith and he had a lot of cool things to say to Timothy. And I want to read this to you. This is 2 Timothy chapter 2 and this is what Paul says a young man should really be strong in. Not, not so much the strength of muscles, you get those already, but Paul says to Timothy in 2 Timothy 2.1, You therefore, my son, be strong in the grace that is in Christ Jesus. The things which you have heard from me in the presence of many witnesses, entrust these things to faithful men, who will be able also to teach others, and suffer hardship with me as a good soldier of Christ Jesus. He said, no soldier in active service entangles himself in the affairs of everyday life so that he might please the one who enlisted him as a soldier. If anyone competes as an athlete, he does not win the prize unless he competes according to the rules. And the hardworking farmer also ought to be the first to receive his share of the crops. Now Paul says, consider what I'm saying, for the Lord will give you understanding in everything. So this is some instructions from Paul to Timothy, and he's telling him, be strong in the grace that's in Christ Jesus. You know, we have so many things that the world's telling us we should be strong in, but grace, grace is one of the most sweetest things that we can have as a young man. When, when you meet pe young men full of grace, it's, it's, a, it's a pleasure because they... You know, grace is, by definition, unmerited favor. We didn't earn God's favor. He just gave us His favor because of who He is. And when we deal with others with that same attitude, not like, hey, you have to earn my favor, you have to earn my approval, but we just treat you with grace because, well, God gave us grace. And because He showed me grace, I want to be a man full of grace, showing that grace to others. I want to be strong in grace. And I pray that you be strong in grace too. From the Caymans out to Honolulu.